I was shocked, man. I was hitting him with some hard, hard shots, and he wouldn't go away. He went down in the second round. I was like, all right, it's over. Let me try to hit him on the ground. And he just, like, the, like a zombie. He just kept coming. He kept eating. And my hands are literally hurting from hitting him so hard. I, I got like 100 plus people here, so I only live an hour and a half away, so I knew I was going to pack the place. So hopefully I gave him a good fight. Hopefully that's good enough for fight of the night. I got a kid coming in a month and a half, so hopefully this, that would help. So please, Sean Shelby, Joe Silva, hook me up, man. The stars were aligned. There was no way I was losing this fight. There's no way. I, nothing could go wrong unless I slipped up an NFL. I feel like it was literally perfectly aligned for me to, to have my debut here and then be successful too. It was pushing me, man. Especially that last round, they all screwed my name. That um, fed off that energy. It was good. It's what got me through that last round too. Because I, I took this fight on two weeks notice and I felt like I did pretty good taking the fight on two weeks notice. I felt like I was one in better shape. I was pushing the pace, so I felt good. I'm happy with the win. We took two, two weeks notice and I feel like I was the fresher fighter. I was pushing the pace. I was trying to get the action going. So I, I feel like that's my big, big confidence booster for me, especially since I've never even been to the third round. That was the first time I ever been to the decision, let alone being in the third round and I felt pretty good going into there, especially on two weeks notice on a full camp, uh, I'm going to be unstoppable. So.